1971 Carmen Ghia. Not exactly a rust bucket. Call it a, kind of a medium condition vehicle. Found it on Facebook. And slowly, just doing an old fashioned garage preservation with what little tools I have and definitely what little experience I have at such an undertaking. Three twenty grit is my best friend in the uh, sanding medium. Rustoleum rattle can is my best friend in the coating department. And the object here is just a simple go over. This is preservation. I don't want it to get any worse. And if it can look a little bit better than it did when I purchased it, hey, that would be called a win win. And that's really all we're going for here. Nothing fancy. Nothing fancy. Just getting it done and getting it cleaned up. Advice if you're going to get one of these is if you can get one that's in what I would call mid condition. It's got some rust, not a lot. The pans on this are really good. The interior is in good shape. The tires are dry rotted. I fill them up every so often. They'll be replaced. It does, like I said, you want to find one that has some rust. And it's going to look a little bit like this. Oh, yeah. We call that rust out. In the old days, you'd take some beer cans, rivet them on there, and splatter some uh, fiberglass or uh, Bondo on there. But I've got a set of rockers coming. We're going to put some rockers on it. I may not do it like my friend Pete. But by golly, I'm going to give it an old college try. We got a little bit of a rust bubble here. We're going to clean that up. A little bit of light rust here on the back. Got some filler in there already. So we got quite a bit of little things to do. Body sanding here so we can see what we got. But here's the original layout. As I bought it, it looked pretty well like this throughout. And we will have another video with hopefully improvements coming up. So thank you for watching. I'll show you the scary part here before we, uh, whoops, get my finger out of there. Conclude here. And all I can say is thank goodness for replacement panels. Y'all have a good one.